what's some of the feedback you got from your coaches and teammates after the game or during uh, the game? You know, everybody's everybody's happy to see me play well, which which is good for you know, yeah. helps confidence wise. Uh, just felt good to have some support around. You know, it's a great group of guys, and you know they want to see us win no matter what, and so they want to see us young guys you know, improve and get better too. Can you talk about what particular you were able to do tonight to really be effective? Um, you know, thought defensively, just you know trying to hold down the paint as much as I can. Um, think as many rebounds maybe as I uh, maybe wanted to, but um, hit a couple of shots, ran the floor. I thought you know got that one bucket in transition. Um, we got guys here. If you, if you run, you're going to get rewarded. So I was a little combination, of a few little things. What did you think of the crowd reaction to? Your play? <laughs> it was it was fun. Um, you know, it's it's fun to have those guys behind you. You know, I know Boston is a great sports town, and you know they they love their Celtics and, and everybody else. So um, you know, like I said, it's, you know, just having fun out there and trying to stick around for as long as I can. With roster moves having to be what do you what do you hope you showed out there tonight? Um yeah, I, I mean I just hope I showed out the wall. That I can play at this level and you know that I can help this team. Whether it's, you know, three, four minute stretches or, or whatever it be, uh, practice, you know, whatever it is, um, I feel like I can step in and help them help them out. Hey, do you have a nickname? We we're coming up with Steamroller. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Steam, Steamer is kind of my Sioux Falls nickname. Um, it's kind of what I've been known as, so it's probably the easiest. Then you don't got to try to pronounce my name either. <laughs> What's it like playing with uh, KG, not only in practice, but also in the second quarter you played a little bit with him? Uh, he's a fun guy to play with. You know, a guy that has been around the league for a long time, knows almost every little trick there is, and he's been more than willing to help vocally on and off the court since I've been here. So it's, I've learned a lot um, in my short amount of time here. You know, I'm just hoping to stick around for as long as I can and keep learning from just keep absorbing up as much information as I can and uh, just stick around. I guess one of the big things you learn with KG is always be alert and always be ready when you're on the court for that pass. Yeah, absolutely. Um, you know, not, not only is he a threat to score, you know, he's going to find guys. And it all comes back to that team atmosphere, the team, the team idea. The guys just want to win. It doesn't matter who, who scores what bucket. As long as we're getting stops and getting buckets, that's all I care about. What do you think your chances for the team? We'll see. Um, you know, I'm feeling, I'm feeling pretty good right now. Um, but, you you never know. Can't get can't get too high. Can't get too low. So I'm just doing what I can every day and trying to improve. And hopefully I do that tonight. I guess at this point of kind of camp, as short as it's been, you have to have the feeling that you did everything you could. You left everything on the court. Right. Absolutely. Um, you know, I felt like I came in and, and showed what I can do. This is you know about as well as I can play. And this at this time, you know, I still feel like there's a lot of room for improvement. But at the same time, like you said, I left. I felt like I left everything on the floor. And uh, now it's you know, whatever's going to happen is going to happen.